Three covers uh, most genres, uh, from rock to, to reggae, R&B to pop, dance to easy listening, ballads, and it's all drawn together and weaved together by the story of my life. This is my story, opens with an Athena Whakamui Misio Karakia. It takes us on a journey from my birth to being adopted into the Tipuna Whanau in Fraser Town. And it takes me through the triumphs and the tragedies of my life. This is my story, and I'm ready for the truth. What about our son is uh, for my, my beautiful son, Te Whakamui and it's about taking responsibility for the beautiful lives that we, we, we make. Um, and I know a lot of women and maybe men can connect to this song. Mr. Right originally was a song written by my beautiful niece Margaret, Margaret Tipuna. Um, and it was called Apart, but um, after a lot of work, um, it transformed into Mr. Right. A big, big thing with me, um, you know, just wondering would I ever find Mr. Right? Well, I don't have to worry about that anymore, but I know a lot of women and men can connect to this song, and I love it. Walk a Mile was one of the very first songs, it's the most popular, and it got the, it got the ball rolling really for this album. It's about entering into a new relationship and coming with baggage, but accepting that and working through it and walking a mile together. Goodbye. I've always wanted a song for my father, uh, Ricky, Oni Oni Atariki, um, who was taken way back in ooh, 1988, 22 years ago. It's a farewell song for him and a tribute to my father, um, such a brave man, and we miss you, Dad. Say a Little Prayer was based on the love that I hold dearly for my Ratana faith. Um, it's about the, the beautiful world we live in and the fact that we all play a part of destroying it in some way. But um, as I was taught from birth, anything, every day, just say a little prayer. So no matter if you're spiritual or not, He's here, and the world's here, and we should, we should treasure it, we should treasure each other, firstly, and yeah, just always say a little prayer, nothing wrong with that. Take a Chance was one of the first songs I recorded professionally with my old band Alive in London when we used to live over there, and it's about taking a chance and, and following your dreams, following your heart, and not being scared of anything. Unconditional. Whew. I always wanted a song for my three angels, my beautiful, beautiful sons, and this is it. Unconditional, a dance track. Never thought it'll end up like that, but it has, and I love it. I love it. I can't wait to zoom into it. And yeah, it's about the love of a mother to their child, and I. I can't imagine life without my sons and the songs for you, my darlings. Sorry was written for a very dear person to me, uh, the father to my children. And it's about accepting the wrongs you've done in your life and having the courage to say sorry. It's not hard. Tell Me Why was written by my beautiful sister Lil and my beautiful first cousin Susan name 
for their, their first husbands who were tragically taken from us back in the day um, as a tribute to them and to anyone who's lost someone dear to them. Haukainga actually started from Koira and it evolved into what it is now. Uh, it's a reggae tune that celebrates my achievements, my, my travel around the world. It also entails how much I missed home, how much I love home and encourages people to travel and go see the world. It encourages people also who live away to to return home and never never forget where you come from, really, and be proud of where you come from. Hokaina. And then we'll end of it. At last, uh, the bonus track. I first sung this at Homai Te Paki Paki at the semi finals. I've fallen totally in love with the song, and I've always said if some poor bugger wants to marry me, I'm going to sing it to him. Um, it's a love song by all, all ages, and yeah, I love it at last.